Hello everybody, Jamie from FM Scout. Today's episode is going to be the best release clause bargains on Football Manager 2020. A lot of people have been asking me for this. Now I've been trying to figure out the best way to do this. I mean, there's going to be another video which has got like the, the best release clause players under a million pound. But this one is generally based on kind of value, um, their, their ability, stuff like that. So that's purely based on this. So if, if you're starting with a big club and you know, you've got a bit of money... And these are the guys, well, they're kind of the best value for, for that price that you're going to pay. Let's get right into it. So the first one is a Tottenham player, believe it or not, Toby Alderweireld. This guy is, obviously you guys know who this is, he's Belgium, 30 years old. Very, very good stats, could probably make it at any, any team in the Premier League for the first few years. He is currently wanted, so he, he probably does, I mean, he's wanted by Liverpool and Man City, which is very, very surprising. So that just shows you, if you've got a bit of money... Definitely bring this guy in. Of course, he's on 50k a week, which is still quite low in all fairness. But this guy has got a release clause of 25 million. And his value, of course, is 36. So to me, that is that is a very good bargain. You know, his, his, his value is very high. When you obviously offer him a contract, you could potentially get rid of the 25 million out of his... Or get rid of any kind of release clause and sell him on the next season. And, and potentially make a lot of profit. That's what obviously the game's about, making profit. So that's the first one, Toby Alderweireld, that guy, 25 million release clause. The next one is Lorenzo Pellegrini. This guy is a centre mid, attacking midfielder at Roma. As you can see by his stats, his stats is very, very good. Now he is valued at 36.5 million. He is 23 years old. A lot of you will know who this guy is, but as, as you can see, like I say, his stats are crazy. He's on 64k a week for 36.5 million value with a release clause of 27. So that is still very, very low. So if you are looking for that midfielder for the Premier League, you know, definitely consider bringing this guy in. He's got very good crossing. His corners are very good. His men, like I say, his mental stats are great as well. And the main thing is, he's only 23. Again, value is very, very high. Moving on to the next one, Jonathan Vieira. This guy is a player at Las Palmas. So 29 years old. Um, he is a slightly older, he's a winger, but his stats are very, very good. Definitely could make it in the Premier League without a shadow of a doubt. You know, for a few years, if you are struggling on that side of the pitch. Very versatile, can of course play um, AMC as well. Bear in mind, I've just noticed that he has got broken ribs at the start of the game. So, you know, he's out three to four months. But if we um, if we just have a quick bid for Jonathan Vieira, that guy's got a release clause of 27 million, which, you know, is lower than his, his value. And that's what, you, that's what we're kind of looking for. They're kind of bargains, right? Moving on to the next one is Feguli. This guy, let's have a quick look. Safian Feguli, Galatasaray. Of course, you'll know him from West Ham. Did previously play in England a little bit. He is currently wanted by Beijing. 11.25 million value. Very good stats. Like I say, you are looking for a player on that right-hand side. Definitely a player that could give you a few options. But if we look at the value of the release clause of 9 million, so sl slightly lower than his value, of course. So a very good player for that price, £9 million. You can't really get this quality for £9 million anywhere in today's football. So definitely look at this guy. Next one is Sarabia. This guy right here is a, 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 um, sorry, a right winger, an AMC. He can play it all along, actually. They can play left wing, AMC, and right wing. But he's at PSG at the moment. He's got a, vi a value of £25 million. Spanish 27-year-old. Technique's very good, vision's very good, first touch is very good, physical, very good. 27, still got a lot of time left. Went to make a bid for him, 22.5 million for Sarabia. This guy, again, lower than his value, which is the main thing. Moving on to the next one, Rasmus Falk. This guy is a Swedish guy, I believe. I can't remember. Pretty sure he's Swedish. No, Danish, sorry. So this, I thought I recognised it. I'm sure there's Rasmus Elm or something like that. But yeah, this is Rasmus Elk. He is a Danish 27-year-old, currently wanted by Bournemouth. Um, he can, kind of, again, kind of versatile, can play centre mid, AMC on the right and on the left as well. Very good stats. Only 27, looking at, like I say, 3.3 million value. If we make an offer for this guy, it's going to cost you 5.5 million, which is a very good deal. You know, 5 million is not a lot of money in today's game. So that's a very that's a big bargain for me. The next one is Moranchuk. This guy, let's have a little look, let's load him up. Sorry, I'm kind of copying and pasting from my list. Um, so this guy is a AMC at um, Locative Moscow in Russia. 23 years old AMC. Stats look very good. A lot of improvements still to come. He has made 147 appearances for Locative Moscow. 
uh, Locomotive Moscow. Again, it's been there since 2011. It's only 23. It's also capped for Russia. But if we try and make an offer for this guy, it's got a release clause of 7.2 million, uh, which is or 7.25, which is really, really low for a player of that caliber. So definitely, especially international player as well. So definitely look at bringing this guy in if you can. The next one, Diego Marine, Marino. Marino. This guy is a goalkeeper at Real Sporting, 29 years old, still kind of in his prime or in his prime at 29. 5.5 million value. Again, one-on-ones, reflexes, aerial reach, very, very good. Six foot two, what you need in a keeper. Very big, only on 7.75K per week as well. If we try and make an offer for Diego, it's going to cost you in the region of 6.25 million pounds, which is a very, very good deal. And the next player will be Ortuno. So this guy, Alfred Ortuno, is a striker at Real Oviedo. 28 years old, 2.2 million value, 7.25k per week. Very, very all-round striker. I mean, his physical stats aren't great, but, you know, he's got the finishing, the finishing 14, determination's good. He's kind of an all-round player, good strength, that type of player. And he's only valid at 2.2 million and a very good current ability. So that's the main thing. But if we try and make an offer for him, it's going to cost you about 5.5 million, which is, is very, very good. Okay, moving on to the next two. So there's two left. The next two are slightly higher. So if you have if you have got a lot of money in your club, um, so obviously uh, Danny Pereo, this guy is 30 years old at obviously at Valencia is on 91k per week. But the reason we've chosen this guy is because, like I say, is valued at 40.5 million. It's currently wanted by you know PSG big teams. But the main reason, look at his stats as well. But the main reason we chose this guy is he's actually got a release clause lower than his, or just just a little bit higher than his value. So 45 million for his release clause and only a 40 million value. So if you tried to bid for a 40 million player in this day, you'd probably be looking at around 80, 90 million, right? So again, is it's, it's still quite young. I mean, he's only 30. He's got a lot, a few more years to play. But whether you want to spend 40 million on, on obviously a centre midfielder, that is completely up to you. But I would definitely look at bringing this guy in without a doubt. And the final one is Franco Vazquez. So Franco Vazquez is a AMC at Sevilla, 30 years old as well, 24 million value, currently wanted um, by Valencia at the moment. Stats are very, very strong, as you can see. If we try and make a bid for Franco Vazquez, it's going to cost you 22.5 million, which is still very, very low. You know, so they're, they're the top 10 bargains that we found in terms of all the prices. So if, if you do enjoy this list, if you plan on signing any of these, please let us know in the comments. And apart from that, I will be releasing a lot more videos on players coming up very shortly. So bear in mind, we're doing two videos per day. So later on, um, there will be a affordable Wonder Kids video coming out later today once you watch this video. Um, and that one you'll really enjoy. There's a lot of players you might have never heard of that you could pick up for slightly cheap wages and, and, and cheap values. So... Yeah, apart from that, drop a like on the video. It always helps, as always, and I'll see you all next time. Goodbye, everybody.